Welcome to Designing Spaces Think Green, the show that's all about you, your living space, and living a more eco-friendly lifestyle. Today, we must consider the environment as part of our economy, our health, and community. A healthier environment means healthier lives for all of us. Designing Spaces believes it's time we take care of our home, the ultimate living space, planet Earth. Tile floors have been around for thousands of years, and today it remains one of the more eco-friendly materials you can use in your home. But is it made to eco-friendly standards? We go to Florence, Alabama to see 21st century tile manufacturing at its greenest. Take a look. Tile. It's been a stalwart building block for homes for thousands of years. But these days, it's no longer made by hand. And there are lots of stylish choices, from earthy, textured looks to slick porcelains. It's great to know that no matter what tile we're looking for to match our decor, we can think green. Designing Spaces recently visited one of American Marazzi Tiles plants in Florence, Alabama. First thing we realize when visiting here is, tile manufacturing has gone high tech. At this plant, even though these tiles are mass produced, attention to quality and detail is paramount. The process starts with raw materials like sand, clay, and feldspar. The quantities are pretty impressive. This plant processes more than 200 large truckloads per week from local quarries, plus 2,000 tons of material brought in by rail. In all, the factory produces about 250,000 square feet of tile per day. These raw materials are deposited into a series of bins which feed directly into the plant in very specific quantities. Everything is computer controlled from the start. The raw materials are mixed with water to make a sludge, which is sent into gigantic high-tech dryers. The resulting material is then pressed into various size blocks, which are carefully checked for thickness and dimensions. These presses work with a force of 6,300 pounds per square inch, so these tiles are very dense and durable. The green unfinished blocks are then sent through a series of glazing lines, which apply various colors, finishes, and textures on the tile using the latest inkjet and rotocolor printing techniques. This creates a surface that is frost, impact, and chemical resistant, easy to install and maintain. Variations in shade and abrasion resistance are controlled carefully during this phase. The tiles are then fired in a series of 300-foot kilns at more than 2,200 degrees. The kilns use low nitrogen oxide burners that reduce emissions by more than 50% over conventional natural gas burners. Some of the products require that the tiles are then cut to specific sizes, washed, and rechecked to make sure each one is perfect before boxing them up for shipping to customers.
The tile produced here in Florence uses a green process. This closed loop manufacturing line reuses water and materials, sending negligible amounts of scrap to landfills. For example, more than 20% of every tile is made from recycled materials, and the plant recycles more than 99% of all the dust created during manufacturing. This process creates products certified no VOC. That means no volatile organic compounds are included or created. And the company has partnered with the U.S. Green Building Council to pursue sustainable solutions to building and business challenges. Whether you're installing it at home or in an office, tile is also a good choice for the environment. Ceramic and porcelain tile are some of the longest lasting flooring products on the market today. The typical lifespan is 50 years. So tile costs less per year than all other floor finishes over the life of a building. Tile is also easy to clean. Without the need for harsh chemicals, it's very low maintenance. Maybe the most attractive thing about tile is the variety of available colors and finishes. From neutrals to warm colors and lots of different textures. Natural looking stone tiles, porcelains, glazed ceramics, glass mosaics, and metallic tiles. Not all of these are made in Alabama. The company has several manufacturing plants in the US, Europe, and Russia. But Marazzi Tile believes that regeneration, responsibility, and environmental leadership start right here in Florence, where this one small footprint may impact planet Earth. Over 25 years, the company has integrated the best approaches in technology, partnering with artists, technicians, entrepreneurs, and forward-thinking individuals. This concept of quality includes social and environmental factors, along with the beauty and reliability of its products. For more information about Marazzi Tiles, visit MarazziTile.com. So, what do we want to leave behind for future generations? All of us have the power and ability to make a difference. Together, let's make the right decision and move towards a healthier world. For Designing Spaces Think Green, I'm David Jones. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.